Hey guys, how's it going? So this video will cover all of the pin dragon pinata locations in all the capitals. So that's Divinity's Reach, The Grove, Radisson, and Lion's Arch. But for Lion's Arch, it's specifically more of a path that I've made on a map. Uh, you just follow the path and you farm it. So how you go about getting the achievement is really just going through the towns and getting them all or just farming the Lion's Arch path for them. Kind of resetting, relogging, changing characters and just farming that path until you have. So let's begin with Divinity's Reach. There are a couple of these pinatas scattered in the outer circle and they're kind of all over the place so just follow these next clips. So for this first one you start from Melanger's Waypoint and head right on the world map. So for the second one, you'll want to start from Khmer Waypoint, and you'll be heading towards the left on the world map, right above the Eastern Commons. From here, you'll start at Ruricton Waypoint and head right on your world map, ending just under the Ruricton writing. Next, Starting at Lisa Waypoint, head down on your world map, directly south. For this next one, you're going to want to choose the Collapse Waypoint and then head left on your world map towards the top of the writing that says The Great Collapse. Finally, for the last pinata in Divinity's Reach, you'll want to start at Osan Waypoint and head up on the world map, nor for the Asan Quarter. Now, Moving on to the Rata Sum locations, you want to warp to the Magustin Waypoint, then just head towards the left on your world map. Next, you want to start at the Accountancy Waypoint and head up right on your world map towards the College of Statics. Next, you'll want to start at the Apprentice Waypoint and head up on your world map. Huh? 
Moving on now to the Grove locations, you want to go to the Reckoner's Waypoint and head right on the world map towards the Maker's Terrace. Next, starting from the same waypoint, Reckoners, you want to head up on the world map towards the Tender's Terrace. From there, on your world map, you'll want to just head right towards the small path just under the Tender's Terrace writing. Next, from the Upper Commons Waypoint, you'll want to head towards the right where the Cultural Armor Vendors are located. Now, from your current location or the same waypoint, you'll want to head down on your world map. Starting once again at the upper commons waypoint, you'll want to now head directly left on your world map. Now, starting from Ronin's waypoint, you want to head directly down on your world map. Now, looking towards the north of the city on your world map, you'll want to start from the Caledon waypoint and head towards the left and a bit down on your world map. From the same waypoint, you'll want to head the opposite way, now towards the right past the vista on your world map. That's it for this location, now let's head to Lion's Arch. Alrighty, and once you've completed all the other main towns besides Lion's Arch, basically what you want to do is go around this town from here to here to here to here to here in this district and collect all the extra pinatas. Um, and that's basically it. It's kind of a hassle, but if you want the achievement, that's how you complete it. Here is another one. Right by the Grand Piazza. So, directly up from the Trader's Forum on your world map, there's approximately four pinatas in this location. Uh, they're all surrounded around the waypoint. There's two underneath it and two on top of it. There's another one right over here by the activity guys. You can use the Traders Forum waypoint to get to it. Another one right beside the other one in the Traders Forum. Here is another dragon pinata in Lion's Arch. Bam. There's another one which I just popped in Lion's Arch. 
Here is another one in Lion's Arch, and this one's still in the central. It's just across from another few. You can either use the Gate Hub Plaza Waypoint, or walk all the way from the Traders Forum Waypoint, or the Eastern Ward Waypoint, and just walk over the bridge. Here's another one in the center. If you hold control, you can kind of look around and it'll help you, but uh, this is, uh, watching this helps too. Here's one more in the center. Actually, a few. One, two, three, bam, jackpot! Fort Mariner Waypoint, walk over. There's one right here. Right across from it. There's another one. Another few, actually. What up there? One down here. And then one right over here. So on the map, that's boom, 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 and up here. And here's the last one for this group. Outside Fort Mariner. There's one right here. There's one right across from this one. So on the map, it looks like this. And then there's fireworks to launch. Near the Claw Island Portage Waypoint. Right over there, just past the bridge. Past this bridge from the Claw Island Portage Waypoint, onto the second bridge, there's going to be two dragon pinatas right here that you can collect. And on the map, it looks like this, right over here. From the second bridge of this Claw Island Portage Waypoint, near the Lion's Gate uh, point of interest, if you jump down the mountain, there is an, an additional dragon pinata that was hiding on me. I hope you guys all enjoyed this guide video to the Dragon Pinata locations across the capitals of Tyria. Please subscribe, like, and comment if you enjoy the Dragon Bash as a festival in Guild Wars 2. Peace!